Are you trying to get a six pack? Or are you trying to get the body that can sell fit tea? Well, me too, but that's gonna take more than just a couple days at the gym. So today I'm gonna show you guys a few tips that will help you get the confidence to go to the gym consistently. What's up? I'm Angeline Tutran, and you're watching my YouTube channel. Excuse me? You're doing a great job and all, but you don't even have AirPods. Hey guys, what's up? My name is Angeline Tuchan, and this is my pimple that we're gonna get over, okay? It's just a pimple. I really hope. Okay, so if your goal is just going to the gym, then I have these two very simple steps that I do that get me to the gym every day. So one, I either drive, walk, bike, skip Superman to the gym, and then two, I gym honestly so it's about creating habits first so when you're first starting out it's okay if you're only there for like 15 minutes 30 minutes like you're there you know and you're making that habit of going there you can even read a book or watch Netflix on your phone but as you get the habit of going into the gym then you can slowly build up to getting good workouts in before I go any further I want to say there are a lot of reasons to not let gym intimidation stop you from getting to the gym all right number one um, nobody cares what you're doing. So, uh, did you see me bench earlier in there? I was, like, benching right next to you. Yeah, what was that? It looks so weird. And that looks really weird, too. What is that? Dude, it's just a pimple. Hey, did you see me bench earlier? I was benching, like, right next to you. Oh, no, I was doing my own thing. Oh. oh okay, I was, like, repping, like, like at least 200 pounds, so. Oh, congrats. Thanks. People have their own workouts to focus on. It's not all about you. I know it feels like everyone's staring at you. It's not like that. It's not like they're judging you. They're just probably staring off into space or just looking at what you're doing. It's never that serious. And you shouldn't be so narcissistic that you think like, oh, they're judging me, blah, blah, blah. Like, we don't care what you're doing with those five pound dumbbells. <laughs> no, seriously, people will stare at you anywhere, not just the gym, okay? I know. It's like very sensitive at the gym because you know your body and everything and everyone knows why you're there and you know why you're there But like people stare at me even at the library, you know, like granted. I'm like naked, but They stare at me there, too. So what's the big deal number two? Nobody really knows what they're doing either Damn, I wish my bow was as big as hers Another day, another dog if only I knew what to do like her. We're all learning and we're all constantly learning and anyone who claims that they know everything there, you should run as far away as you can from them. And that will be your cardio because cardio sucks. Excuse me, what's that workout called? To be honest with you, I don't even know. Alright, you're probably wondering, what's the secret? What am I going to tell you in this video that's going to set me apart from all the other videos you've watched about getting into the gym? Drum roll, please. The truth is... Nothing. Nothing I'm going to say is going to be different from everything you've heard before. And you know you've heard it all before, but you're still looking for the Krabby Patty formula. Well, it doesn't exist. A healthy lifestyle will really boil down to consistency and patience. If you don't like or love the gym, don't go. There are plenty of other ways to get a healthy lifestyle, so I suggest just finding out what works for you. And if you want it as bad as you say you want it, but you're scared of going to the gym or a public gym, there are always private gyms, you can make a home gym. It just comes down to how bad you want it. My former coach made a great Instagram story today about how even the top athletes are not motivated all year round. That's humanly impossible. So I would also say it comes down to one last thing, discipline. Oh my God, so 
Okay, we just finished and I already look way better than I did when I walked in. The pimple's gone. One workout, that's all it takes. At the end of the day, we're just all trying to live our best life. So go out there and kick some butt and have some fun. Don't care what anyone thinks. I know it's easier said than done, but we only live once. But I'm trying to die with a six pack. So catch you guys at the gym. <laughs>